Okay, today we're looking at the Subaru CVT. At the moment we have a version 2 in our hand. Version 1 is very similar, but the solenoids are configured a little bit different. Uh, we're going to endeavour to unclip the TCC solenoid from its harness. It um, can be a little bit tricky as it's enclosed by a little plastic housing as you see here. The TCC solenoid in both models will be the green and the grey wiring. Um, the trick is to grab the harness, it's not as simple as it looks, and try to get underneath, as you crimp the two sides, should you leave you a little bit of a gap to get your screwdriver underneath, and start to pry the plastic housing away. Take care, you must dislodge the wires forward to release them from the plastic housing, then the housing should slide away fairly easy. Once you've done that, being careful, you can then remove the two wires from the solenoid and the solenoid's left exposed. The good way also to ensure that your solenoid is um, faulty is to measure resistance across the two terminals. It should be as specified in our catalogue between 9 and 13 ohms. Um, if yours is out of that range, you've definitely got a faulty TCC solenoid and then can re be replaced in a reverse procedure in the way it was removed.